Fireball of Death Yard seems to be the perfect way to cruise around the city of Steelport. Not only in Sexy Kitten Yarngasm can you find such a mode of transportation. Outside of Yankee Bull 7, what's your favorite way to get around? Not in Burnett's You aren't afraid of heights, I think. If I have to choose between getting mutilated by the drivers in this city or a carefree flight with a view, I think the choice is obvious. But what if there's some sort of uh, malfunction that causes the chopper to go down? Parachutes are a wonderful invention, Zach. And if a shoot fails? Try all you want, Zach. I'm still beating you to work in the morning. <laughs> I have no idea what you're talking about. I saw you putting sugar in my gas tank last night. This is therapeutic. symphony be played out for our fans. Then you and the fans must be tongue deaf. I don't think that's what Sexy Kitten had in mind when she designed this cult. Sometimes genius is discovered by accident. Look at how champagne came about. Bobby, are you saying you'd listen to a recording of this match in your car on your way to work in the morning? Absolutely. I would be a little worried about drifting off to sleep, though. How can that possibly be a worry? Well, this sounds just like the streets of Steelport outside my window at night. Puts me right out. I'd be drifting off right now if it weren't for the Saints flow I just had. Yeah, just salt in the earth. Was it too much for you? Eh, so much for that. back to Sad Panda's very own Sad Panda Sky Blazing here at Genki Bowl 7. We've seen our contestant complete the first level of this course already, and just as expected, this thing can soar with the best of them. No doubt, but eager to please the fans, Professor Genki has ordered the difficulty ramped up this second time around. Speaking of eager to please, let's check in down on the streets with our girl, Tammy. What you got? I'm standing on the rooftop downtown with executives from several Steelport banks. Champagne is being served by scantily clad women, while a lot of bets are being placed on how this saint will perform today. What's the spread for today's match? Only those buying in are giving the numbers, but this wager may explain the seven jumpers that were scraped off the street after the last match, Zach. Ooh, ouch. So that's why my bank closed down. Those mascots didn't have a chance. Time for I'm the mascots. I'm beginning to feel bad for the Sandhammer, Zach. Why is that? Well, how would you like your face to be synonymous with unethical? But the unethical targets are the ones usually avoided, Bobby. So you're saying it's better to be ignored? No wonder she's so depressed. Yes, the rampage is about to begin. And that was the two seconds of free fall between fending off attacks from monkeys with machetes and falling to the carpet of buzz saws. Here, you don't have that same risk. Good point, Bobby. You know, unless, of course, the parachute doesn't work. Or a plane flies into them. 
Right you are. Or let's say wild panda hunters on the ground start shooting. <laughs> okay, now you're stretching it. Pacarac Island is the target to land on for the bonus, but the contestant has to hurry. Oh, my God! The saint cleared the rooftop! Unbelievable! Get ready for the rooftop, Bobby! the end of the match again. Bobby, fans, Zach and Bobby here bringing you some exciting Genki Ball updates from the genius Professor. That's right, Zach. We've just received word that Professor Genki has decided, in honor of Genki Ball 7, to make a public appearance on the streets of Steelport. And I also hear that the Master of Ceremony will be escorted by none other than our current Genki Ball frontrunner, the leader of the Saints. If you want to meet the genius guy yeah, that epic extravaganza of one set of carnage, then head to Leather and Lace. And while you're there, go ahead and pick up a gimp suit for that special someone in your life. That's all from us. We'll be back later with more coverage from Genki Ball 7. You know, I could use a gimp suit. Still remember the print base?